How does one wind up playing college ball at Norwich University in in Vermont? How did uh, that happen for you, Pierre? Um, I remember like it was yesterday. I went to a recruiting fair, you know, down in South Florida at my high school. And um, Coach Yes, Coach Yes Aloni from Norwich University came up and said, hey, we want you to come on a visit to Vermont. Mm-hmm. And I was like, all right, cool. You know, I don't know where it's at. Uh, never <laughs> seen snow before in my life. No kidding. Yeah. <laughs> Growing up in Florida, we only know the ocean. Sure. <laughs> but um, he came up to me. He was interested in me and didn't have too many colleges to choose from. And they were like, hey, come up on a visit. And I was like, all right, cool. And so you went there? And- went on a visit. It actually started snowing on the visit. <laughs> but we were just excited to be in Vermont, be out of the state, just to be, you know, on a college campus. We didn't know mm-hmm. what we were getting ourselves into. We didn't know what to expect. We were just happy. Just, you know, young high school kids just to say, hey, we went on a college tour. And... You know, I fell in love with it. One of my friends actually did. He came on a visit with me. He played on the same high school team, but he didn't go to um, Norwich University. They wanted both of us, but I ended up going and, you mm-hmm. know, we, you know, that's that's how I ended up. In, that's uh, how you, uh, and then you saw snow fall for the first for time the first in your time, life. Uh, in and you said, I still want to go. Yes, yes. I I was embracing it at that point. Well, good for you. <laughs> Where, what, why, why were you not recruited by any schools in the state of Florida, best you can tell? Um, academics. Okay. was one of the main reasons. I, I honestly didn't know that you had to do well in school. I didn't know you have to do well on the SAT and ACT. I, it's just I just didn't have an older brother or, you know, a mentor. To be like, hey, you should start taking huh. the SAT or should get hired in a 2.0. Not just get a 2.0, get hired in 2.0 so mm-hmm. your grades can level out with your SAT scores. I just didn't know that. So it was an academic situation. Yeah. Not, yeah. not It an was a- just a not like if I didn't know, like I just tried. It was like, oh, you got to get a 2.0 to play High school football, all right, cool. I'll just try to get a 2.0. I didn't know, like, you mm-hmm. know, if I try to get a 3.0, 4.0, or, sure. you know, higher, that it would be easier to get to a Division One school. And once I figured out I had to do good in school, yeah. then I put my mind to doing well in school, and I actually did better in college than I did in high school because they're like, hey, you need to do well in college. There to play, you go, sure. <laughs> to, play, to play sports. I was like, all right, cool. And then how did you wind up at Mount Union? How did that happen? I, I actually had a friend that went to Mount Union, and he was telling me about Mount Union, and at some point I got tired of Vermont. <laughs> Uh-huh. <laughs> then I was like, uh, you know, let me try out Mount Union because if I went up in division, I had to sit out a year. But if I go across, I can, you know, play and, you know, play the same year and keep moving forward. And Mount Union was the best decision. I, I actually sent <laughs> Coach Larry Karras a VHS mm-hmm. tape of me from um, Norwich University. Yeah. And um, I actually put it in the postal service, not FedEx or UPS, the regular. <laughs> Snail mail? <laughs> yeah, it's a regular postal and um, they actually showed it to me when I showed up on campus, the, the VHS with an athletic tape on top of it with, uh, huh. you know, my name and number on it. So they um, they were interested. I sent them an email and, you know, they was like, hey, you just all you got to get, all you got to do is uh, fill out these paperwork and get you qualified and financial aid and all that stuff. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on radio stations across the country and audience. Isn't it amazing you can download an app with your thumbprint? You should download our app with your thumbprint. 